Hey yo, what's good guys? Today we got 50 differences between American English and British English. I want to give a big shout out to Anna and JT YouTube channel. I saw them do this video first, so I I'm stealing this idea off of them. So, fair Okay, fair. I'm going to show give you 50 credit. things, okay? 50 different things. I just want you to tell me what you see, how you call this thing that you're looking at, okay? okay. Starting with this one, what do you see? A purse. purse. Uh, it's a handbag, I would say. No, What's purse. in her hand, the green thing? Oh, yeah, wallet. wallet. Yeah. Uh, that actually is a purse, because it carries her money. This girl has some hair on her forehead. What do you call that? Uh, honestly, I just call that hair. Like, I, I, I don't I don't pay attention to, like, hair shit, man. Like, it says bangs. <laughs> fringe. Call it a fringe. I've heard bangs. I've never heard fringe before. What's in the, in the corner of the room? A teddy bear. What's what's the teddy bear in? A uh, crib. A cot. What's the baby wearing? The baby's wearing a diaper. We call that a nappy. Where are these children? In a nursery. Um. Yeah. What What's another name for it? Kindergarten. Kindergarten. We don't say kindergarten. We say preschool or playgroup, something like that. What's this? A bar of soap. Look closer. An eraser. Uh. Yeah. We call that a rubber. I. I I'm not gonna lie. I was looking for something else, in the, like I was like, w am I supposed to be looking at the white? I, I feel dumb. I I don't like I do plenty of dumb things, but that I feel dumb. But yeah, I would call that an eraser. Rubber. Why is that funny? A rubber. Why, why would it what does a rubber mean rubber, to you? Condom. <laughs> yeah, that would be a condom. But like, but like. Why? Why though? A a rubber would be like anything that's rubber. Honestly, I I could see a rubber being called a condom before I'd see an eraser. So this is a school no, it's and not a rubber. It's wh whatever, whatever. There are boys and girls in the class. So how would you describe what kind of school this is? Co-ed. We would just say mixed, it's like a mixed school. This teacher, she's having a class and she wants to check that all the students are there. So she's going to do what? Take attendance. We would say she's taking the register. Do you say taking the register? No. Okay. What's that? Band-aid. Plaster. What's she got on her face? A zit. Or? A pimple. We say spot, a spot. Or... Okay, okay. I don't like that he's forcing certain words. Like, her answer is a zit. He's forcing her to say pimple. Right? Like, let her answer what her natural thoughts are. Or we say spots. Like, in England we say, oh, I've got a spot. Or I'd I've say, got some spots. I'd say, oh, I have a pimple or I have a zit. These people are graduating from? College. College. University. Okay, so you've left university now, you get a job, and you ask your boss for more money each month. Raise. What would you call that? A raise. A raise. We would say a, a pay rise. Extra bonus marks to anyone in the comments who can tell me what Steuern means. Steuern? Is that another word for raise? I, I don't know. Let me know in the comments. What does that mean? These people are on holiday. What are they? What's the name that you could Forest? give to these people? Vacationers. Vacationers, yeah, we would say holiday makers. What? What's this girl lying on? These people are on holiday. What are they? What? Tourists. Holiday makers? They're not the people that arrange the holiday. Like, a holi wouldn't a holiday maker be the person who, like, their jo it's their job to arrange vacations for other people? Wouldn't that be what a holiday maker would be? Huh? What's the name that you could give to these people? Vacationers. Vacationers. Yeah, we would say holiday makers. What's this girl lying on? A floaty. Yeah, floaty. A lilo. What are these boys up to? Having drinks. Partying. Uh, I think one of them might be about to get married. Oh. Bachelor party. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, we would say stag do. Stag do. And... You know what? I like that. I like that. Yo, we out having a stag do with my mate. What do you rate my British accent? I just turned British. Yeah. Girls. Bachelorette party. Bachelorette party. Uh, we would say Hindu. One place these girls might go on their Hindu is to this place. What's it called? Tenerife. Tenerife. Yeah, that's how the Spanish and Walter White says it. Tenerife. I I've never even heard of that place. Okay. Is, is anybody 
Anybody here of Tenerife? No. But in the UK, in England, we just say Tenerife. So the hens Never went to Tenerife. What if the stags went to this place? This is a Russian city. I think it's the capital. Moscow. 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 See, Americans say Moscow. We say Moscow. Well, you'd say cow. C O W, cow. So why wouldn't it be in Moscow? Get out. Get out. <laughs> the main account that you have your salary paid into each month, what do you call it? My checking Check account. It. We say current account. This man is wearing a vest. Hat. Waistcoat. Uh, I looked at the hat. Immediately I looked at the hat. This is what we call a vest. What do you call this? An undershirt. An mm. undershirt. Undershirt. I can't I can't think of the name I normally call those kind of shirts. Wife beaters. Wife beaters. Shirt, okay. That's what What's this? Those. A couch. Yeah, I sometimes sit on that in my vest. <laughs> we call that a settee. Uh, What's yeah, this girl getting? Shots. shots. Shots? She's far too young for that. <laughs> she's getting a uh, she's getting a jab. She might be her jab. meningitis jab or a tetanus jab or a MMR jab, measles and mumps rubella. We don't say shots. These are shots. What's well, that, yeah, you're correct. Those are also shots. Yeah. What's this guy doing? A pumpkin. Uh, <laughs> what's he doing? <laughs> oh, throwing up. Or, well, and do you have another word for it? I've heard this word on The Simpsons. Barfing? Barf, anything else? Throwing up barf, yeah. We say chunder. Do you... See, like, I don't like how he's trying to force words out of the lady. Let her speak what natural... Because, like, what you got to understand is, and it's the same in the UK as I've learned on this YouTube journey, different areas have different, like, sayings and ways you say it, and... Hell, even have different meanings. So it's like, where things I call certain things in like in the middle middle of the U.S. in Illinois. I lived out in North Carolina for like I want to say five six years. They call it completely different things. We just live. I mean, it's not completely different, but we're. There are differences. You say chunder. We do not say chunder. I've don't never know. heard anyone say chunder in my life. I just chundered everywhere. <laughs> what kind of store is this? A liquor store. A liquor store. We would just call that an off license or a alcohol shop. What's happening to McLovin here? Get He's getting carded. Carded? Does that mean you're asked to show your card? Yes. Okay, we say ID'd. Hey! See? See? Hey, listen. See? I'm British now. I'm, I'm, I've turned British. Look at that. Yeah, I've never heard anyone say getting carded in my life. I'm, I'm not gonna... This is what I was saying. Like, I don't know where she's from, but, like, she ain't from Illinois. You say carded. We, we say, say carded. ID'd. Hello, Mindy. <laughs> If you've seen the film, you will know that he does successfully get sold alcohol, and then shortly after, the shop gets um, raided, and some guy comes in, punches him in the face, and tries to take money from the... Cash register. Yep. This is a register. till. Cash register. A lot of people just call it register. What do you have stamped on the bottom of a beer can or a Coke can? Expiration date. Yep. What does the BB stand for? Best Buy. Best Buy. We would say best before. Mm. What's this? Paper towel. Kitchen roll. A place to buy these things. A drugstore. Drugstore. We don't have drugstores, we have pharmacies or... Yeah, yeah, we say... Pharmacies is off more often what I hear than a drugstore. But I'm not gonna lie, when I was looking at those, my fat ass thought they were candy. So... I, I was... Immediately the lyrics to Candy Shop popped in my head, and that's what I was singing in my mind. But, yeah, pharmacy is more what I hear than a drugstore. Chemist. For example, Boots is a chemist or Saibaliya in Arabic. What is this? Uh, sandwich. Uh, it's long and thin and kind of circular. Do you have a special name for oh, that? Oh, a hoagie. Hoagie? Do you really call them hoagies? We just call it a baguette. That's a, that, that's a sub! That's not a ho What the fuck is a hoagie? Hoagie sounds like you're about to hock a loogie. Do you don't know what that is? That's... Just look it up. I'm, I'm not getting in. That, that would be hock a loogie. Hoagie. That's a hoagie, okay. What's going on here? It's being broiled. Broiled, B-R-O-I-L-E-D. What, what does that mean? We say grilled. Grilled? For us, grill is like 
when you're outside, you're cooking it over fire. Like that's a grill. To uh, what? So what do you guys call a grill? Like the American version, which is like it's normally outside, cooking it over a fire. It's powered with gas or charcoal. This so is a grill. It's cooked on the top. So do you call this bit at the top the red broiler. bit? Do you call it a broiler? A yeah, broiler. It's a broiler. We just yeah. call that a grill. What are these hanging? Drapes. Curtains. Curtains. See? What's this? See, I'm British. Th yeah, that's a subway. subway. Yeah. This is an underground or a tube. Certainly, in London, it would be called a tube. Europe, it would be metro, but we don't really use the term subway. It's certainly. I've heard. I've heard the term metro used before. I've heard the term metro used before. Subway. I've never heard the term underground used. Well, I've heard it actually used on like YouTube videos, watching like people that live in London talk about things like that. But I've never actually heard it in my like day to day life. Not in the UK. Okay, so here's a question. This snow Snowing. is falling, but it's too warm for the snow to stay on the road when it hits. So we could say the snow isn't. Sticking. sticking yeah. yeah, it's not sticking. We... I, w I was about to say staying, but sticking is more the proper term for it. Say it's not settling. So if it snows, but it doesn't stay, it doesn't settle. What's this? RV. Bus. We call that a coach. Wait, did I... S sticking. Yeah, Why it's not sticking. We say it's not settling. So if it snows, but it doesn't stay, it doesn't settle. What? That's not an RV. I, I don't know why, like, my mom... Yeah, that's a bus. She's correct. That's what I call that. I don't know why in my brain, I pictured that as, like, one of those, like... the You know the, like, newer upper class RVs? That's what I... I don't know why, but that's what I pictured in my brain. Listen, I... Today ain't my brightest day. I've been up for a very long time, and I'm not the brightest right now. What's this? A bus. We call that a coach. This guy has bought a Passport. a plane ticket. It's going to take him there and back. What do you call this kind of ticket? Round trip. A round trip. We'd call it a return. What is missing? Enter your something code and press Red enter. Card. This is at the gas station or the petrol station, as we would say. The zip code. Zip. We'd call zip. it a postcode. What's the... I, I, I'm about to go to sleep, man. I, I give up. I'm about to... I, like, I... I'm not having a great day right now. I'm just not. <laughs> For fuck's sake. I need to go to bed. Y yes, we would call it a... Z I need to pay attention to what's in front of me. What is missing? Enter your something code and press enter. This is at the gas station or the petrol station, as we would say. The zip code. We'd call it a postcode. What's the punctuation at the end of this sentence? An exclamation Please. point. Yeah. Exclamation, exclamation mark. mark. What's this? Question mark. Oh shit, do you call it the same thing? Hey! <laughs> let's go! <laughs> do we? What's this? Quotation marks. Yeah. We'd say inverted commas. What's this? Colon. Yeah, colon. colon. Yeah. We yeah. say colon. So that's like a pronunciation thing. Colon, colon, right? Colon. But you still spell it O-N at the end. Yeah. Not one of those. What's this? Windshield. Windshield, Windshield. Yeah. yeah, we say windscreen. So this okay. is a car and the headlights are on. They're on their highest setting. So what do you call that? Price. High beam. High beam. We say full beam. What's this? Chocolate? Uh, no, actually, it's not chocolate. Try like again. Debris. Batteries. We say debris. What would you call the takeaway that you get? from the place uh, which is called China. Takeaway? Yeah, but what's it called? Chinese food? Chinese. Chinese or Chinese? Chinese. Yeah. Which, which syllable do you put the emphasis on? The Chinese or the Chinese? Remember. Please answer in the comments because I'm really curious Chinese, about this. And I guess um, apparently on the e's. We can't come to a conclusion here. What's this? Dumpster. A dumpster. Skip. What road are these people driving? Highway. Highway. Motorway. Who are these guys? The cops. Please. What's this little fella? A ladybug. Ladybird. <laughs> hey, it's Hank Hill's dog, y'all. Hey, it's Hank Hill's dog. Shout out King of the Hill. I'm I'm not gonna lie to y'all. I feel like I need to like re-record this video when I'm well rested because it's just not my brightest like like, I see myself having so many stu- 
Is this what it's like to watch my videos? Because, like, fuck's sake, I'm dumb. <laughs> Listen, I feel like I need to re-record this when I'm well-rested. But give me a fat-ass like, comment, subscribe, ring the bell, click all. Let me know what you want me to do next. And I'm taking my sleepy ass to bed. So good night, y'all. Bye.